Good morning, beloved friends. I'm Reverend Kira with Unity Bay Area Houston in League City, Texas. And we are moving this week into the follow-up to our Path to Enlightenment series. And as we have gone through and followed the steps of Jesus and understood what it means to live from the consciousness of our own Christ awareness, our own Christ principle, Christ consciousness, whatever way you want to understand that, our true inner nature, that we are moving forward in ways that are inviting us to really know that we can live alive in spirit. Alive in spirit, what is that? It is that aliveness that many of us have hard time, I guess, agreeing and understanding is fully available to us here and now. Just as the disciples had a hard time at first accepting the news that Jesus had risen, the fact that he had resurrected and he was able to pick up and put down his body. And absolutely, there was something magnificent happening by his experience and expression. And there is something magnificent happening in you and in me when we open ourselves to the true flow of the divine that is moving through and always bringing us to a, a greater aliveness of spirit but we have to choose to believe it, to believe it's true. And just like we're going to look at all the times that Jesus presented himself and understand the metaphysical understanding, what it represents for our soul's journey to believe in this higher truth. Uh, this is a, a, we teach in the in unity tradition that the Bible is a story of our soul's journey from that uh, unaware, earthbound consciousness to an awareness of our true inner magnificence to our Christ consciousness. And then how do we live into that? And the story doesn't end with the resurrection. And we have an opportunity to begin to embody this true Christ principle now and say, what is it to live from a place of being alive in spirit? What is involved and what is, is required for us? So if you've wondered what these Bible stories mean in terms of your own life, in terms of the way that you live in this world today, and you engage life and understanding, come and find out more, Unity Bay Area Houston. We have so much going on there. And the first thing is that we accept all people and we invite you to come no matter what your faith is, no matter what way you practice your faith, we have ways that can help you in deepening your own inner realization of the divine. We are so filled with gratitude for the light that is within each one of you and for each one of us. And we know that we're here to be that living embodiment of that light. And we are called to be alive in the spirit of truth, in the spirit of life, in the spirit of light and all the ways that that would inform and move us forward. And we study these principles of the metaphysical or the, or the higher understanding of the soul's journey in the Bible. And we'll be looking at the, the times that Jesus presented himself after the resurrection. And what does that mean? What did it mean to them? What does it mean to us? And how does that, uh, that aliveness then begin to transform our lives, to live from a higher frequency, a higher vibration, to come and unify a world and bring forth a oneness that Jesus knew and understood and was inviting us all into. It is a great, great day every day to practice these principles of unity, these principles of universal truth, and to live into them in ways that, that create lives of joy, lives of harmony and peace in our world. So we'll hope you'll join us. Now, this Sunday is special for another couple of reasons. We will be installing our new uh, board members uh, with a special ceremony uh, in the midst of the service. And it is always a great pleasure to honor those that dedicate themselves in service which we have so many in our unity midst that are dedicated and serving our community that we all may move together into higher expressions and bring forth a greater good into this world and fulfill the mission and purpose of our ministry. You know, we are uh, 
are here to empower you know, lives and to awaken minds and and transform hearts. We we truly want to see that difference made in the world in your individual life. So we're going to celebrate our our board and and invite a ceremony with them. Following the service, we are having the final moments, the last time to bid on our silent auction art items. I wanna say a great thank you to everybody that came out yesterday. We had an amazing art reception gallery night um, and had a, a full house and we were grateful for all of those that came and all of those that are in the process of bidding and uh, all of our amazing artists. It is such a privilege to see the, the power and the presence of those artists that are bringing spirit into form in their creativity. And so we'll close out our silent auction at 1230 on Sunday. Now, if you still are wanting to get in on the bids, you can come on Sunday and do that. You can contact our office from 10 to two today and tomorrow and, uh, and put a bid in. There's somebody there that can help you with that. Uh, you can reach out to us and let us know that you would like a point person to help you at those final moments to be part of the bidding. There are different ways that you can get involved. We can have a proxy person there helping, you know, do your bid and watch the flow. So whatever way it works for you, we are just grateful that you are here on this planet at this time, bringing the light of God, the light of, it, of the infinite into form and being a presence for that in this world. I look forward to celebrating with you and all the ways we celebrate and look forward to so many great activities we have coming, coming forward. Look for our Earth Day activity on April 22nd. Everyone's invited, just like all of our events. Great family fun, food, bouncy houses, activities to teach Earth care for children. Everybody gets takeaway gifts that are Earth friendly. It is gonna be a fabulous day as well. We just celebrate continually at Unity Bay Area Houston. And we'd love to have you come and live in the celebration of life in all of its aliveness and spirit that is alive in us. God bless you friends, have a fabulous week. See you Sunday. Oh, you can join us. If you can't make it in person, though we'd love to see you in person and share in this high vibe experience, you can join us on our Facebook page or our Unity Bay Area Houston YouTube page. We do live stream our services in both of those places. God bless you, friends. We look forward to seeing you soon.